Movie. Oh, bullshit aside. I know. I need to stop spending money. Once I get paid this paycheck, I'm doing the right thing. I'm budgeting it correctly. Today is the next day. And so far, no pay stub. So, I've been seeing your guys' comments and exactly what you're saying is what I've been telling myself for the past couple of months. That is the reason why I started this Getting My Life Together series. The whole point of it was to stop spending money. The whole point of it is obviously to pay off my debt, which with what I'm making is extremely possible. But I'm just not doing the right thing. Started off good the first month with my Amex debt. My Amex credit card, we paid it off in two weeks. I believe it was about $700. Ever since then, we've paid off a little bit onto our other debt, but way more could have been paid off. And that is because of poor budgeting or lack of budgeting, just not budgeting at all. And that's a problem because when I started this channel, I used to cash budget. I have the binders to cash budget, but I don't do it. And not even just that, but budget it on Notion and my phone, my notes. I tend to not do it because any free time I have, I get distracted. And that is one key thing I need to do again. I need to get rid of distractions. When I need to use an app and my screen time is on, I do get the code and then I end up using distractions again so today is going to be the last day without the screen time i also need to get rid of youtube on my computer other than that i feel like i've been doing good work wise by work wise i mean youtube channels i feel like i've been doing a good job posting editing and also producing content we started uploading on the gaming channel and we're about to get that up and running and then once we have that up and running we're going to be able to slowly start slowly start posting on the athletics channel as well all that is obviously work in progress right now what we need to focus on is paying off my debt which will make everything else easier let's look at the spending column Today is obviously not the day that you guys are watching, it's the next day, but I'm ashamed of how yesterday went, especially after seeing your guys' comments. So let's go over how much we made in April and how much we spent. Our goal is obviously to pay off our school's first loan, which we still owe $2,000 to, as well as pay the rest of the interest debt that we owe Best Buy, which at the moment is about $600. So we got $2,600 of debt to pay off this month to complete our goal. And we also want to have a little bit for ourselves. As you guys saw earlier, I put money into starting the clothing brand Hoodie Drop. I only bought 10. Once those 10 sell, I plan on reinvesting that into buying more 10, more 10, more 10. I'll do small drops and restock and hopefully the demand goes up so high where we'll probably be able to do some pre-order drops and get them out whenever people want it. That's obviously also work in progress. <laughs> Let's go on to April and how much we made. This is only from construction because refing obviously most of the time is cash. But from construction we made $3,438. That is crazy. I don't know exactly when we refed. The videos are up so I'll probably look into that. Not today but <laughs> in few, uh, maybe for the end of the month we could go over the comparison of total income in April compared to May. 3500 is crazy what that number is crazy and i know it's going to be more this month which is why i'm trying to stop myself before it's too late let's see where our money went into we spent 4602 well basically 5000 if you include bills and utilities 1500 dollars went into debt that's 30 percent of spending that's not bad that was actually pretty good um that included my amex debt what else my school's first loan best buy loan and then all the amex payments oh and the um apartment debt we got zell my girlfriend um jose which is ref rent as well this has gotta be rent yeah so that probably changes it up a little bit yeah, Zelle has dropped to 260. Okay, cash and checks, which is basically ATMs, 590. Like, that's the thing. I didn't track that cash, so, well, I spent it. <laughs> it all basically disappeared as well. Oh, 422. We got Shopify. We finished paying off the hats in April. eBay, Notion, hats, 
rocket money creator set so yeah basically things that helped us out for the content or any business thing we're, we're working on which is not bad i'm actually happy that we spent more on business than reckless spending reckless spending is all 7-eleven and cash up april i actually didn't go to 7-eleven as much what that's crazy the month of may Giselle gifts. It was my girlfriend's birthday in April. I spent 215 on her. Dining is basically any dinners. Um, I don't know why 7 here. This should be first reckless, reckless spending. Blaze Pizza. Yeah, basically anytime me and my girlfriend sat down and ate. Ganja, 185 on weed in a month. We are gonna try to lower that. I'm t I promise you, I'm gonna budget correctly. I'm not gonna get rid of it entirely, but I am gonna budget for these small things that I guess I don't need, but obviously uh, consume on my daily basis. 166 in gas. Some of it, I don't even think is gas. <laughs> but 166 in gas isn't bad, especially given how far I do drive to work. Fast food, 119. Damn, 119. Damn, how's it 119? Carl is mostly him huh? Chick-fil-A. Damn, Chick-fil-A was the most expensive, but fees. Why is 100? Oh, I got a fucking ticket. I forgot about that. I don't even remember half of these until I look at it. I'm like, oh, I remember it, but there's no way I would ever remember I spent money on that without this. <laughs> if I wouldn't be able to look back on where my money went and how it was spent, I wouldn't be able to reflect. I wouldn't be able to have a different perspective than when I was buying it. Looking at it now, I was like, damn, that's how much money went into that? I can't even imagine how much these past couple of days alone I've spent on just just it can literally be going into something beneficial even if it's something like this even, even this camera was more beneficial than any of the expenses I've made in these past couple of videos and I know that I know that trust me no matter how many times you guys tell me I know that and <laughs> I'm getting to a point where I don't know what to reply anymore I'm, at this point I'm not even gonna reply and I'm just gonna work on it I guess that's why these past couple of days well, that's, that's where my money went into, basically. Here's a little pie chart. But I guess that's why these past couple of days, I've been feeling a little, not less motivated, but obviously I'm not doing what I'm setting myself out to do. I'm daily uploading, but am I really improving? Am I really doing something right? Am I really providing value? Yeah, I'm going through a struggle, but you guys see me going through a struggle enough, haven't you? Ha am I not tired of going through a struggle? Am I not tired of doing the same old bad things, bad habits? And every time I always seem to go back to the same word, discipline, self-discipline. Why is doing things so hard? 